Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Deidre Barrett White. Today we're going to be focusing on the topic keyboarding technique. This topic is very important to the typist as it helps to increase keyboarding speed and accuracy, increase productivity and efficiency, and it helps to prevent repetitive strain injuries and fatigue. Keyboarding posture is very important for a typist. Posture speaks about the way in which a typist sits while at the computer and the way the typist's arms, wrists, fingers, legs, and feet are placed. The correct posture is always very important. The typist should ensure that they sit up straight with shoulders and neck relaxed and back supported by a chair. The feet should be flat on the floor. Eyes should be on the text to be typed. The body should be centered in front of the computer. Elbows naturally should be by your side. Curve your fingers over your keyboard with your fingers gently touching the home keys. Some would say to keep your fingers positioned as if you are playing the piano. And your wrists should be low but not touching the keyboard. Keyboard and technique. Now, technique is the form and key in style that a typist uses when operating the keyboard. It refers to where the typist positions his or her fingers on the keyboard and the way in which the workstation is arranged. The correct keyboard technique should always be practiced by a typist. What it is? The typist should ensure that they press the required keys gently with the tip of the appropriate fingers. Keep your eyes on the copy. Return your fingers immediately to the home keys after you type each key. Proofread carefully after you have finished typing to identify your errors and to ensure that your typing is accurate. And once you have identified your errors, please ensure that you correct them all because no document should be completed with errors. What are some of the effects of poor typing techniques? It gives fatigue to the typist. The typist may end up with stiff or aching shoulders, back or neck. There may be numbness or pain in the wrists, elbows or fingers, which can lead to injuries, repetitive stress injuries, some call it repetitive strain injuries, two of which are the carpal tunnel syndrome and tendonitis. Your workstation. The workstation speaks about the arrangement of the monitor, the keyboard, mouse, copy, and the copies of text to be typed, and other materials on the desk. The typist should always ensure that everything is properly arranged so that he or she get the best out of the typing experience. And finally, please remember to take frequent breaks. We should always try to rest our eyes, shake out our hands, and stretch and stand as much as possible. We should use the keyboard shortcut keys whenever possible to avoid constant use of the mouse. Two of which, Ctrl N will give us a new document, Ctrl Save will save our document. There is a video that I have on this topic. You can always go and look at it to get a better understanding of the various shortcut keys. You should also ensure that you have a good attitude and patience. And finally, practice, practice, practice. Practice can never be enough for a typist because the more the typist practice, the better the technique will be. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, share, and subscribe that others can benefit from the experience. Do have a wonderful day.